clean up. Blah, blah, blah. blah. One month long. Good day, YouTube, and welcome to another episode of the Albino Rhino Booze Review. You have the Rhino, you have the Manchild, you have the Honey Monster. Uh, we have Cap 357 Maple Rye Whiskey. Bullet Whiskey? Oh. oh 357. Tap 357 is a product of Canada. It is from Montreal, Quebec, Canada. Oh, that's good. It's 40.5% alcohol. If it's from Quebec, they might have real maple. 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 It, it says, because the Frenchies know, they know hockey and they know maple. <laughs> that's this, <right>. this blended <laughs> yes. small batch whiskey is a marriage of two purely Canadian flavors, rye and maple. And the rustic, authentic character blow, who cares? That's all we're going to Blah, 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 it's maple whiskey. Yeah. Um, rubber stopper. Uh, I could never have a rubber stop. I'd just chew it. That's old timey. <laughs> yeah, I would. I would chew it. That's my, old timey. Nineteen tens. My oral fixation. I'd just chew on that for fucking hours playing World of Tanks. <laughs> you should totally <laughs> say oral fixation. You play World of Tanks? Though? Yeah. Everyone was playing World of Tanks. You wanted our clan? I'll quit when I'm in. Then I was in RCAF. All right. Cool. I'm not playing World of Tanks. You should play World of Tanks. Premium members. Gold rounds. No. No. <laughs> okay. No. I get to play the artillery though. Sure. <laughs> Bruce Mayer from the Lincoln Alone is our other artillery guy. Oh, shit. I played the Suicide Corps. Yeah, I need to drive as quick as, oh, you go fast to, as I possibly what, can. And then crash into something. <laughs> no, BT-7. BT-7. <laughs> BT-7 and Panzer threes. Uh, drive as fast as I possibly can and crash into it as fast uh, as I okay, can. So. Oh, all right, so back on topic. We uh, have a little world it doesn't actually flowing. smell very good. No. No, it doesn't. Well, you know what? I'm this, not getting this much This might be good. I'm not because getting a lot of maple because you're not getting alcohol. you're not getting that bullshit artificial maple flavor, which is no. You're, you're, you're getting whiskey, but I'm getting you're whiskey getting, more getting than maple. You're getting a little bit of yeah. vanilla. You're getting your rye. You're getting your cereal grains, which is good. So maybe this is more balanced towards the whiskey than it is the maple. This might be this, like the case where where the real thing doesn't taste as good as, like like as as directly good as as the fake thing. Yeah. I don't know. I think this might have some potential. Uh, unlike most Let's people, I actually enjoy drinking whiskey. Yeah. So oh, I don't yeah, mind yeah. when yeah. things taste like whiskey. Lot of oh, that's good. Yeah. Oh, and it's real. It's real maple. Real maple syrup. Yeah, real maple. Yeah. Where it's nice all finish. Yeah. Nice soft undercurrent. Yeah. Um. You're getting some aging. It's giving me body tingles. So you know. Yeah, yeah, nice body tingles, yeah, which means like. like <laughs> yeah, you're getting some. Uh, you're getting some real alcohol flavor on yeah. that one. Um. You know, uh, if you sold the glass after you're done, too, the maple really comes out. Definitely stronger, definitely more whiskey. tilting to the whiskey side yeah. of this, yeah, which I really the like. The Courard de Bois was like drinking maple syrup. It was amazing. The um, the Crown Royal maple was like drinking table syrup with alcohol. Mm -hmm. It was it was still okay. So this is a hint of maple, which is yeah, nice. Yeah, this is just a hint of maple. This is, yeah. However, but they nailed the back half of the maple taste. They did. The See, this half. is the thing, right? This was... Um, this bottle was like thirty nine dollars. Well, that's that's still well within the range of a twenty. A good no, I a know. A good twenty sixer. That's if well I'm buying if I'm buying a maple whiskey for that price, I want more, more maple flavor. More maple. Yeah. Because that's the reason I'm paying the extra money. Okay. It, okay. I'm happy with Fair this. Enough. Shot. I disagree with you. This is way better than that last shit. I I enjoy this more than I can. Now. I could see where I, I could see where Chad is talking about though that no, if you see, were to go out to buy, you're basically whiskey, buying a you liqueur, want maple, right? You yeah. want maple. As a as a whiskey, I enjoy this more than the Crown Royal oh, maple yeah. whiskey. This yeah. is great. however, as a maple, maple whiskey, product, it's as a maple, maple whiskey, I'm not happy with it saying maple whiskey. Yeah. I think it should say well, like maple finished or something like that because it just doesn't have the flavor profile. Again, my favorite so far is the Cour de Bois. Yeah, but like, there's a difference between what we're essentially saying is. When you drink these other whiskeys, you're essentially drinking a liqueur, right? That's what Whereas they end this up tasting like. This is a maple flavored whiskey. whiskey. Yes. yes. This tastes like whiskey, but you definitely have like okay, yeah. there's a subtle, nice hint of maple within it. Mm. I appreciate that a lot. Yeah, you're this is something that I would be happy to drink all night instead of the other ones where if you drank all night you would poison yourself. See, I think I could drink the Coeur d'Ivoire all night. No, we I drank, drink, I drank the Coeur d'Ivoire all night yeah, together. True. And I had yeah. no problem, no hangover, yeah, no that's nothing. True. Me, me and him did drink a bottle together. Yeah. Um, oh, fair enough. Now, the crown. The crown I would wake up with. Oh, the crown is terrible. Because it's the fake maple. Yeah, yeah it's fake. See, maple again, this is real maple things. in it. I just think that it doesn't have enough maple flavor mm -hmm. for myself to be considered a maple. But yeah, like I do. I agree with you completely. This is completely removed from a maple whiskey as more of this is a rye whiskey with a maple hint to it. Yeah, that's my thing. This is more just a normal rye whiskey. With a flavoring. Very hint. wonderful. 
Yeah, it is. See? It has, it, and it's a soft undertone. It does cut the, it cuts the bitterness a little bit. It's even forty point five percent. So you're getting yeah. 0.5%. Well, that's why more. that's a whiskey and that I, I mean, like here. Yeah. See, I don't know. I'm going to disagree with you guys. I really think that what we're seeing here is the other ones are very much, when they say they're maple whiskeys, what they're basically saying is alcoholic maple syrup. Yeah. Where this one is a whiskey. Not a liqueur. That, that it does, it does balance extremely well. Well, see, it all matters as well when they put the maple in this, right? Because they could have put the maple in before fermentation, well, distillation. Uh, and I that thought you mean, said you couldn't. You, you can. Okay. But you're not going to get a very good flavor. That's why I'm saying we don't know when it went in. Yeah. Because if you put it in before you distill it, you're going to get more alcohol, yeah. less flavor. Because what's going to happen sugars is the yeast directly is going to yeah, yeah. eat the yeah. eat the sugars and make it into alcohol. Yeah. Where that's the big thing, right? Like you look at Coeur de Bois, it's thirty one point seven percent alcohol. Which to me is a liqueur. To most, but it, what it is is it's a whiskey, and then what they do is they take the maple syrup. And they add it to the whiskey after it's which done distilling, down the which brings down the alcohol percentage. Now this one's forty point five, so the alcohol percentage is still up there. So they probably didn't add it at the end, or if they did, they made like a fifty percent alcohol. And this then is a blended. It down. One. This is a blended between three to five year whiskey. Um, like realistically, I I like it. I like it in its own category. Um, well, it's just it's just like the pumpkin beers that we talk about, right? How we say that there should be two pumpkin beer yeah, categories: pumpkin a pie sweet and, and, a, pumpkin spice. and yeah, a, pumpkin spice. a sweet and a spice. Yeah, this should be this should have its own category too. You know, like I think I think it's in the right category. Like it still does taste like maple, maple yeah, and it still does taste like whiskey. And the only thing that's different to it is you just get a little more whiskey. I, I wouldn't want to take anything away from it because I really like whiskey, and this just adds a little hint of it. Which means you don't, like, unfortunately with the other ones, what you lose is the whiskey taste. You lose the whiskey taste. You keep the whiskey burn, but you lose the whiskey taste. The Crown Royal had that. I, the I Cour de Bois had that. This uses a different part of the, of the maple flavor. Right? This uses the back end of the maple flavor as opposed to the front end of the maple yeah. flavor, which the other ones have. Because, like, I, I, do, yeah, I, I think despise, it's a little more subdued. I generally yeah. despise pumpkin ales. Right? Because, like, like, when you guys go out and you go, yeah, this is pumpkin in a glass, right? A pumpkin, yeah. Well, I'm like, well, fuck that. I want beer. Beer. Yeah. <laughs> well, see, the thing is, that, that's true. I agree in that regard because the pumpkin, though, when you buy a Southern Tier product, you expect to get the flavor that they're advertising. Well, no, you I, don't I'm expect... not trying to slag them either. No, 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 right? but I understand yeah, what no, you're saying. Yeah. Like, this yeah, like, one is when whiskey. You go out, yeah, when you maybe. go out, that's why I'm... I actually agree with you in that yeah. regard. I think this product is superior in many ways because it is actually whiskey. And, and, and I've had, a, a, lot lot of, of I've had a lot of real maple syrup, right? And it, yes. it's not that... Because it's not that maple, it's that back here, that yeah. maple, you know? Like, it's got a different, like, weird, like, refined sweetness. It's got, like, a different whether they're using an amber, it. whether they're using an early season or late season maple. That's true. I mean, it makes a huge difference. Because I would think with a whiskey, you'd want to use a later season uh, amber. Like a darker I really, amber. I really like this shit, man. It's good. I, I do, too. Him. It's well, whiskey. no, I, yeah. I never said I didn't like it. I'm oh, just saying that I, I really do like it. You I'm just saying, an asshole. That's all. when you say a maple... <laughs> When you're saying maple, I want that maple flavor. And yeah, I'm, no, to be fair. I am yeah. getting it, yes, but I'm getting it subdued, and that's the only reason why I think it should be maple flavored, not maple but whiskey. When you look at the Domain Pinnacle, you're well, getting maple. Well, to be fair, it whiskey. does say on the back that it's like a, two purely Canadian flavors, right? Yeah. Rye and, ma and maple. So you're going to get that balance, and I think they're going for that balance, and I think they got I think they that balance. Well. I think they and did I think it really it's well. an excellent product. Is so that out of 10? I'm going to say 8. 9. I'm gonna give it an eight point five. Very good product. I give it a nine. It's fucking. It's good. It's whiskey. Yeah, it is good. It With is whiskey. Real maple fucking flavor. But again, I don't like and it. Again, I don't necessarily. I would, like I would buy another two. bottle of it. I would. Yeah. I like it. I will drink it. I'm gonna give it an eight two five. Um, I am in the eights because I would buy it again. Again, mm -hmm. my thing with it is it. It just doesn't have enough maple for me. You gave it a nine, and the maple dance is a no face. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. You gotta do it. Do it. Maple dances. How do you guys even remember this shit? We don't. We just <laughs> make it up as we go. I, I, I don't yeah. even remember like the <laughs> fucking day before. I'm doing an old face with you bent over the table. Oh yeah. Oh 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> I hope we got that. Oh 